Welcome back. We are catching up with John Paul II High School football and more media day. With the head coach at John Paul II, Kevin Wald. Yeah, you got that right. It's the coach at John Paul II now. Moving from uh, Hilton Head Prep, you did a wonderful resurrection job there. Uh, why would you go and try to have to do it again to take uh, John Paul II from, from eight man to 11 man? Why'd you put yourself through that? Well, this will be the last rebuilding job I take. Uh, <laughs> let me make that clear right now. Um, I don't know. I just I thought the time was right. If I was ever going to do it again, it was it was now. Um, listen, it, it's the potential that John Paul is is there's no end. The school started with 56, 57, I believe, and we're going to be up around 215 this year. Just three three years later, I believe. Um, and how many you got playing football? Right now we've got 22. Good. Which is pretty good. Better pretty than you good. started with in prep, right? Sure, sure. You started with sure, 12. Sure. Um, it, it's, you're comparing apples to oranges a yeah. little bit because there the guys had some experience coming back. Here we've got so many guys that have never played before, which, which has positives and negatives. Positives are they're being coached the way we want them to be played. The right. negatives are you just don't have the experience. But I, I guess the backbone on that, when I went out there in December, the, the feeling I got walking through the school, I knew that's where God wanted me to be. Okay. And it was an easy, easy decision to make. So, right. You know, aside from uh, Coach Summers over at, uh, at May River, y you have to have one of the most exciting jobs this year amongst all these coaches. Uh, I can only, from what I've seen, I only see superb things coming out of JP2 in the program. So I would imagine your feeling of excitement that level is way high, is that right? Absolutely. I mean, I, I don't always show it on the outside, but on the inside, I, I know where we're going. And, and I think it's going to be sooner rather than later. I, I don't know how much this year, but if the guys, and I keep telling them every day, you keep working hard with a great attitude and you give great effort, good things are on the horizon. So we'll see. What's your timeline? What, what is the level of success you want to see this year? And, and, you know, and, and, what are your goals? Knowing you kind of mute them a little bit, but then you got to set them too. You well, set them very up. simple. Each each day, going back to spring football, we've gotten a little bit better each day. Like Monday, we looked a lot better than we did on Friday. We went full pads Friday and 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 hit a little bit. And I, I think I cried on the way home. I didn't hear any pads popping. <laughs> I, I I said, "Oh my Lord!" But then we come back Friday, we fix some things, and it, it was a night and day difference. Um, so as long as we do that, we're going to be okay. All right. We're looking at a guy with no gray hair right now. <laughs> remember that. Yeah, remember that when we get to November. Yes, sir. <laughs> Good luck to you. Thanks so Thanks, much for guys. spending Thanks some time for with us. Me. All right, Kevin Wald, uh, new head coach at John Paul II.